Help! He is a hideous human being. Fantastic. I've always wanted a wife. My thongs. <laughs> Andrew, I can see them. Oh my god, it's 6.58. Oh my god. Oh god, you gotta hurry, 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 slouch. Did she see us? Did she see us? I don't know, Mara. The window's over there. What are you doing? I'm reading an email from Susie. Really? The yellow pollen in her scratch is from the Lonicera hirsuta, also called the hairy honeysuckle flower. Does a horny honeysuckle grow in Reedville? Hairy. No, it only grows in the Berkshires. Then you can tell me about the hairy, horny flower later. Let's go get blueberry waffles. I said we were having lunch. I didn't say where. Oh, it was wise of you not to tell me what lunch was, either. What, you don't like cold, greasy corn dog? You're very attractive. Raphael wasn't your boss, was he? Can you please stop calling him Raphael? Uh, no, he wasn't. Raphael is his name. In a Harlequin romance, you're a little Harlequin romance yourself. What do you mean? Well, in the space of two years, you found out your biological dad is a gangster who's about to star in his own RICO trial, and mom, a renowned humanitarian who is nice to everyone but you. What else? Let's see, am I forgetting something? I gave my kidney to a half-sister, I don't know. I think I'm more of a Dickensian character. I think it could be the rod of Asclepius, which often gets confused with a caduceus. Who would get confused? Well... The caduceus is two snakes entwined around the magic wand of Hermes topped by wings. Right, who doesn't know that? You'd be surprised. Well, the intake vacuum pressure pulls the fuel through and mixes liquid with air before it sucks it into the combustion chamber. Mm, go on. Violent explosion rams the big piston down with great force. A long connecting rod forces the crank pin into rotation, which is what you want. God, love to have my crank pin rotated right about now. Mm. Okay, you guys are making me really uncomfortable. <laughs> what are you doing? Checking your body temperature. Don't stop. Why are you doing it? Subtle signs of sexual arousal include a rise in temperature. I am not aroused. Well, it is nothing to be ashamed of. Put out your hand. Give me my coffee. Mm-hmm. Tremors. You know it's too much caffeine. What? No. Mm. Yes. No, no, no. Mm-hmm. No. I don't know what you're talking about. Come here. What are you doing? I'm taking your temperature. It's a subtle sign of sexual arousal. Guess what? You know I can't guess. I'm gonna have coffee tomorrow. Jane. And the next day. You're impossible. I know. Eat your kale. <sighs> okay, but I'm having french fries for dessert. <laughs> of course you are. Ooh, what are you doing to him? Shh. Acupuncture is supposed to be performed in a calm environment. With all of your masks of death staring at him? They're tribal ritual masks. You don't find them soothing? Um, not really. Oh, not those. What not those? You have six other identical pair. They're not identical. That's black patent, black suede, kitten heel. I wish I had just one matching pair. Donation buy. No, no, I paid to have it tailored. Why, so we could lord it over all the other frumpy frocks? So help me. If that is Amazon delivering more shoes, I... Oh, Marche. Aha. Uh -huh. Her hypocretin levels were low. Aha. Uh -huh. Why are we saying aha? Uh -huh? Well, it correlates with the HLA gene test I ordered. Aha. Uh -huh. You didn't get the bullet up yet? Yeah, Mora, come on. Body's been here at least 30 seconds. Are you looking through my personal files? <sighs> well, if you don't want anyone looking, don't label them personal. Personal, related to a person's private affairs. What, are you doing what I think you're doing? How did you know I'm looking at porn? No, wait, I logged in as you. Dr. Isles is looking at porn. Oh, what? Over. Oh. So if 
It was a seizure. Are we looking at natural causes? Oh, compulsions are a neurological response to many stimuli. Physiological, pharmacological, idiopathic. So, maybe? I drive fast because I have to walk slow. Well, you shouldn't be driving at all. And you routinely drive at least 12 miles over the speed limit. I'm doing three miles an hour, Mora. Well, I don't mean now. I thought you liked driving in the Keno Espresso. I think it's an audit. What are you worried about? You break out into hives if you lie. I mean, if you cheat on your taxes, you're probably gonna get leprosy. Oh, yeah. Oh, that feels great. I could do this all day. Okay, maybe we need to spice it up, add a little music. Yeah, or we could dub in buh, 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 bitch Oh, that was good. I could rap for you. Okay. That's, that's spitting. That's, that's not rapping. That's what they do. No, um, here. Here are. That's what do I can't share. <laughs> snagged the carotid. Notice I said snagged. I noticed. Notice how much I would love to know what the murder weapon is. The carotid artery was pulled until it tore. And notice you said pulled. I did, by a weapon with a curved end. Okay, we'll put out an all points bulletin for Captain Hook. Excuse me, waiter. Sorry, I don't work here. I told you to wear a dress. Jane, are they here? ring and the bolt through his ear. That's our lead agent. Yeah. No, Mora. No? No. <laughs> what? No. Why are you eating their plants? Fresh lavender. Try it. What are you doing? Looking up the peer-reviewed studies on violence in men's rooms. I'm so full of crap. You're shoe shopping. Stop eating my fries. Give me my tablet. No. Order dessert and I'll think about it. Mmm. These are really good with the fresh mint. Ugh, enough with the plants already. <laughs> There's a gash in his sartorius. You mean his thigh? No, I mean his sartorius. It's a muscle in the thigh. Get this. When he lost a squash match, he peed in his opponent's locker. Wait, he urinated in it? That is what pee means, yes. Uh. You ordered the Satan special? Satan. It's a wheat protein used as a meat substitute. It is very nutritious. They dissolve the starch to an insoluble gluten and then cook this elastic mass. Can't wait to dig in. Oh, uh, the extended panel results came back. What? Why didn't you tell me? Because you were busy accusing me of ordering you food from the underworld. I love Satan. OK, tell me. I never made the team. That's not possible. The advisor said I was wordy. You? It's institutional beige. I'd describe it as more of a taupe or a sand color. Perhaps even a muted coral with a hint of abalone shell. Am I being wordy? A little. Pink froth. Not cytoplastics, hematoma of liquidity at a cellular level. No. There are alternaria spores and maybe even rhizopus in your pastrami. <laughs> hey, Jane, let's run. It's not too far to your apartment. Now you want to run? Come on, I finally feel like it. Mm, things I do for you. You're the only one she listens to. <laughs> she doesn't listen to me. Where's Jane? In the cafe. I told her not to move until she iced her ankle for 12 minutes. See, I told you she listens to you. <laughs> Mora can't go to Salzabaranovsky prison alone. Go, Jean. Oh, things I do for you. You're a very good detective. And a very good person. Once you've had your coffee. <laughs> Excuse me. Attention all inmates. Whoever did this to my friend's face will have to look over her shoulder for the rest of her life. And if it happens again, it will be a very, very short life. You know, we spend our entire lives with dead people and that's how they thank us? No disrespect. He says none taken. <laughs> what? What's that? He says, you're a great detective. Find out who did this to me. Oh, yeah, Don Corleone has nothing on you. <laughs> Just when I thought I was out, you pull me back in. Well, can we give you a hug now? It won't help. Can we try?
It's beautiful, though. What is it? That kind of friendship. Yeah, we would die for you. I don't know that I'd die for you, but I'd come damn close. Me too, Jane.